Hello everybody and welcome back. Last episode, we found the doctor and Evelyn. This happens to be the doctor's house of healing. and Evelyn was in there. Uh, we made the uncomfortable decision to choose between two critically ill patients, uh, which one to cure with the magic stone that Evelyn had. So we questioned her about that stone, and when she did the healing, it actually upgraded us at the end of time and told us that we had unlocked another room. So the first thing we're going to do today is, uh, I mean, there's a lot of unanswered questions still. We found a key, but we don't have a chest that it unlocks. There's a chest in this room at the doctor's home, but uh, nothing unlocks it. So that's still a mystery. We still don't know where Jake's body is because uh, we dug up and found the sheep's corpse, so we've still got that to figure out. And uh, it's just getting more and more complicated. But there's uh, first things first. If you're enjoying the series, please subscribe. I do appreciate it. Thank you very much. We're going to go to the end of time and see what's new with this room that was mentioned. Welcome back, Source Hunters. I've been eagerly expecting you. You found another star stone, haven't you? Go on, go on. Ask me how I know. <laughs> okay, I'll bite. How can you tell that we found another stone? Aha! Mere child's play when you know what to look for. And luckily, I do. Do you remember when you first arrived on this plane, when the dormant portal that led us to this hall sprang to life? It's happened again, my friend. Another portal has reignited. The end of time is growing by the stone. Wonderful. I, I wonder if it's what Evelyn had. Had to be. It's all connected somehow. You... This place, the void, the stones, soon will have unraveled the whole truth. Oh, how I do love a good mystery. <laughs> what have you discovered through the new portal? You don't imagine that I'd presume to explore it before you? No, 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 that would be most unmannerly. And not to mention, well, the... the... What is it? No, oh, I'm sure it's nothing. It's just that beyond the portal, I sense a, well, a presence that I can't quite account for. It is at once powerful and faint. Perhaps only a shadow, perhaps more. Hmm, interesting. But this is only speculation, of course. Come, come, let me show you the way. Once you're through, you'll be able to report exactly what we're dealing with. Okay, it sounds like a plan. All right, well, we're going to follow him. Aha. Uh -huh. This one right here. Well, uh -oh. okay. Interesting. I think what I'm... an impressive room. Yes, it so is. So it is. A hall fit for kings. All right. I'm gonna save just to make sure. Okay. I don't know. Uh, all right. Let's see what's going on here. Let's see if we can speak to her. You. It cannot be you. But it can only be you. The guardians. Those I deceived. Those that deserted me. 
But oh, how weak you have become. As weak as you used to be strong. Look about you. You used to lead and now, now you follow. Ignorant of your faults and ignorant of your fate. That it has come to this. Woe to the world that it has come to this. He won't believe me, the fiend. But they have come, as I prayed they would. We've unlocked the Hall of Heroes. If you dismiss your companions, they will come here to rest. Okay, uh... There's some cheese. That's good food. Roasted pork, we're gonna take that. Um, let's have Wood Woodgriff take take some also. Uh oh, there's somebody else here. John well, Smith. Wouldn't you look fine with a strapping warrior at your side? Or is it mages you prefer? An eagle-eyed ranger? A stealthy pickpocket? Take your pick of my swords for hire. Oh, well let's see what you've got. I thought you'd never ask. Hear that, swords? Line them up. Oh, well. Berthold the Barrel. Oh, he's a cleric. Regenerate, freezing touch. He can heal. Oh my goodness. Yep. <laughs> I think that, that, yeah, we want him. But what does it cost? Let's see. Cleric. Got Lady M. Mulgara. Oh, you have to be level 7. Flo, level 11. Calandra, 19. So we are going to go with Bertold. I have been one. Oh, 360 gold. We'll see if it'll let us. Awesome! We've got him. We now have a healer. Okay. Okay, I don't want to do anything. Um, end. Back again, and not a moment. You know. Okay, let's look at you. Holy hand grenade. <laughs> What's, what do you got on here? You just got the basics. That's fine. Okay. Oh, wow. I am excited about this. I want to change the way that we move because I like the one... I was looking at this off camera. Because right now we're at this, and I was wondering why Scarlet kept tripping the traps. And it's because she was just following the formation that I told her to be in. So we're going to try this one for now. See if that doesn't help. Well, fantastic. What other uh, surprises are there here? I wonder. Whetstone wheel. What does this do? Is it sharpened? I don't know. Okay. Decorative sword. Right. We've got beds. We can rest. An ancient letter. Let's check that out.
esteemed generals, all of Rivalin thanks you. All of Rivalin is in your debt. Gods and kings bow before you both, and it's right and proper that they do so. Even they had thought all was lost, that the world was to meet its end, but you turn the tide. Many have fallen, so very, very many. And I know you've suffered a great personal loss as well. No, generals, that I sympathize deeply. So let us meet in the Hall of Heroes, both to celebrate and to remember, to honor the living and honor the dead. Signed, Henry, son of, son of William, righteous king of Ferrol. Oh, righty then. Interesting. Is there anything else? What's up here? What is this? Wolgraf spotted something. Oh, what did you see? Okay, well, Scarlet, you are the reader, so let's uh, have you pick that up. My friend and ally. The war has been won. Our victory is now inevitable, a fact, a certainty. One might say these last battles we wage are therefore pointless conflicts. But if the enemy won't relent, so be it. Truth be told, I relish in their stubbornness. Give me bloody combat. Give me the thrill of the front line. I shall be the first to break their ranks and the last to leave the battlefield. But you, you've been absent lately. It goes without saying, I prefer to see you by my side. We shall meet again at the funeral, I suppose. Until then, I bid you adieu. anything on this side. There's a chest. Wolgriff? An empty grenade. Okay, well, you can have that. anything else in there. Ooh, we've got some stuff over here. It's another book. Is that the same diary? No. My fellow general. In victory, life has taken an unreal turn. Everywhere I go, it seems I'm revered not unlike a god. People feel graced when I look them in the eye, considering it a blessing. Children try to touch my hand or sleeve, believing it will bring them good luck. The absurdity of it all is staggering. Above all, I wish I had more time to myself. Some much needed peace of mind. Now that peace is finally in sight. Peace of mind. The closing of the coffin was seared into my sight. The dull thud of stone on stone echoes still. You may relish in combat still, but I have lost all appetite for carnage. Oh. That's kind of depressing. Got a couch here. Some books. Nope. What's in there? Okay, well... A very interesting place. A second piece of source we found, but she still got the item. 
I guess just finding it is all we needed to do. We didn't need to actually collect it. Very cool. Okay. Well, we are going to leave. So we've got some business to take care of. We now have a cleric with us, which is fantastic. Who do you think that creature in there was? I haven't the foggiest. But the eerie bit is that she seems to know us. Yeah, she left too soon. I didn't get a chance to question her. Let's go what talk to uh, what <laughs> lies at the heart of it. What lies at its heart? Why? Good to see you on the shelter plane. A home away from home, is it not? It is. Let's discuss the rooms I discovered here in the shelter plane, if we could. What can you tell me about what seems to be a great banqueting room? Ah, yes. The Hall of Heroes. Once upon a time, great feasts were held there in honor of heroes graced by the gods themselves. In that room, mortals and immortals dined side by side. I can't think of a better place to gather new heroes, should you come across such rarities, so that when needed, they can serve you in your quest against the void. Do you know more about this lady that we met behind the portal? She was kind of a different species. Like you, she is a mystery. But she seems to know you, doesn't she? Perhaps you'll meet her again and we'll learn more about her. The right. Lady of Time, the Weaver of History, I am your biggest Let's fan. Let's get out of here. Lady. Walgraf stands awestruck by the Tapestry of Time. Even if he had a voice, you know he wouldn't find words for its majesty. Yeah, he's probably not sure what the heck is going on. <laughs> That's okay. He's not a source hunter, and I really don't feel like explaining it to him at this point. Uh, let's go to the North Gate. I don't know. We spoke to Evelyn and the doctor, and they really didn't give us any more information. Let's, uh... Beyond these walls. Go out this way. Let's go outside. Where it's raining. I feel like I've just had a long bath in a cold lake. <laughs> okay, let's see. Is there anything new in this stuff? Ooh, a mug of wine. Well, we'll take it. Okay, there's undeads here. Um... What do we got here? We got an armored decapitator, undead swordsman, and a half-eaten zombie. Oh, alrighty then. Who's first? Wilker's first? I put him out of the picture a little bit. Okay. Let's move you up here so you can heal everybody. Boy, you have a lot of movement points.
took you out. Freezing touch, but that's more of a melee, isn't it? Yeah. Regen and. Okay. Oh, good, he missed. Okay, Woodgriff. Woolgraf, I mean. I like this fire wand. That seems to work fairly good. Okay. The time of your death is at hand! Sweet! We've got all kinds of goodies. All right, we're going to have Wolgriff pick up all this stuff. Okay, nobody got hurt. We're going to save again. Check out what's on this corpse. Hair. Ooh. Well, that's kind of. Lizard mystics use every part of every animal. Perhaps you can find some use for this. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. All right, we're in. We're in new and different territory now, gang. Never been here before. Uh, let's explore just a little bit here. Got some more undead over there. Don't know if I. Oh, let's come over here. Oh, that's a scarecrow. Okay, so this is a farm with undead and bombs and alrighty then undead archers and a swordsman okay well we've got to try and get you Scarlet. Knockout blow. Okay, Roderick. Gotta keep that cleric up near us. Oh yeah, they're gonna get us from there. Damn I'm it. warm as fresh apple pie. What'd you do? You healed him? Poisoned. This isn't good. Okay, Wilgriff. Okay, 
Can you? Can you get out of the poison? Scarlet. They fall. I like this game. Okay. Oh, it's immune. All right, Roderick. Get out of the poison. Okay, doctor. Okay, who needs it the most? Probably, well, probably yourself. Um, but you don't have enough points to do anything. Just so it's okay. Um. All right, Scarlet. You're hurt. You need to take that. Can't use any of our spells. See. Hopefully that heals him. Okay, Wilker. We are going to... Oh my goodness. We need to get over here. I think he's going to heal himself. Well, no. He can't. Freezing touch. What, if, what is this shield? Okay. Let's see if we can't get behind.
Okay, that's not going to work. Okay, she can't do anything to him, fortunately. Fantastic. Of course, you're still burning. Do you have anything? Oh, we can't do your inventory while you're in battle. Uh, okay. points. But your health is pretty good. Scarlet. I'm warm as fresh apple pie. Oh yeah. You guys quit stepping on the fire. Let's see. Never rains, but it pours, eh? Yeah. Can you heal yourself? Sweet relief. Okay. Done. Coming after you, buddy. <gasps> okay, well, nobody's burning anymore. Scarlet? Oh, you can't get close enough to hit him, though. No glory oh, yes, you in can. this death. Fantastic! We lived! Oh my god! Okay. Let's regroup, everybody. Over here, we need to heal. Wow, that was a long fight, too. Okay. We don't have any more of those grenades, but... Who needs it more? Scarlet. On the mend! Okay. Now. Ah! <laughs> She's gonna heal quite nicely. We're gonna get everybody healed up here. Um. Well, Griff, you need to check things out here. I'm gonna see what we can find. Pick up the mushroom, the gold, fire spell. Now, is there anything over here? Avatar fire scroll and old wooden shield. Okay. And 
Roderick, you can get healed next. Sweet relief. Bless the seven, I am restored. A bale of hay. Oh, there can be something in there. Roderick, let's go check that out. Some wheat, we can make some flour. And a wood pile. We've got some arrow shafts. Oh! Fantastic, send those to Roderick. the cooking, send it to Scarlet. Now we're going to put a couple of these scrolls down here. Now this shield, we're going to send it to Scarlet because she has a shield, but I don't know if it's very good or not. Okay, Bert, you need to heal yourself. Got to finish exploring this area a little bit. There's a chest. Wilgriff. Nice. The water arrow can go to Roderick. Oh, that's garbage. That is... about what he's got now. That's okay. There's an elm short bow over there. A sack. Oh, more wheat. Yes, please. Okay, well, we really don't want to fight anymore, most likely, but what is this? Oh, a waypoint shrine. Fantastic. Desolated farms. Well, let's go back to the end of time. Well, we didn't really get any work f uh, for Jake done, but uh, that was fun. We got to do some new stuff. We've got a new cleric with us. He actually looks like he's not feeling too good great but in any case he's a wonderful healer and made all the difference in that fight thank you for joining me today if you enjoyed the video please give me a like and subscribe hope to see you next time take care all bye bye now